Hey YouTube. I uh, got a little project uh, in between working on the uh, camper shell. I needed to solve a uh, an issue uh, with fuel cans. All right. So when I'm off camping, filling up the generator, the side by side, or what have you, uh, I need. To, uh, everyone hates having to hold up the gas can and everything like that and sometimes it can just get, get unsafe and start pouring it around everywhere so I came up with my little idea in my head set my cat down here uh, make a little mobile uh, electric uh, pump station I've got to get some uh, some bills to secure the uh, the line down to the box but basically I had an old ammo box and I ordered uh, this battery off of Amazon expert power uh, is a 12 volt 7 amp hour 7 amps amp hours at 20 hours uh, here's my ratings over here on the side I've got a trickle charger a solar trickle charger, I think it's about three amp, a three watt panel, or it might be a two watt panel. Can't remember, I looked at a lot of them. But I got that coming in, should be in the mail tomorrow. I made little jumpers off of it, off the positive and off the negative, so I could click those alligator clips into here. Um, I'll run the wire through here, charge it up. Um, I have a fuse down here. Um, I just put a 3 amp in there for right now. This is the same, if you followed my other pump videos, this is the same 12 volt low pressure pump that I had. Uh, this is quarter inch hose, so I got online on Amazon and found, uh, ordered some gates, uh, six, uh, quarter inch, six foot hose. This is for my outlet. And then I ordered another set of six foot for my inlet. I hooked up a, uh, filter, a gas filter right here. So I can, in case I'm out and I open up my can and I actually get some dirt or debris in there. Or who knows, sometimes I've had clean gas cans go to the gas station, fill up, and there was some, some junk in the nozzle. And I get it, I get home and open up my can top and it's in there. So I just wanted to make sure that I was filtering any fuel that was coming into the pump. And also it is filter whatever I'm pumping into, whether it be my generator, uh, if I have to use it to pump, to put gas in my truck, because if I was not very smart and didn't fill up gas before I went camping. <laughs> but like I said, I'm gonna get some, I got some U-shaped clamps that I'm just gonna mount the hose right here. Um, I'm going to get some, uh, some cord handles, some, some rope handles and just do right here so I can pick it up it is literally just simple this can't this box had cost me $2.99 on sale the battery I believe I paid about $15 for online um, I've already had the 14 gauge wire I've already had the connectors um, I already had the fuse holder and I already had the uh, the switch but it is a loud pump. It's it's not quiet, but you know it's loud and ticking when it's working. We're gonna go ahead and get it kicked off here.
nice clean gas. I'll probably make a little hoop, a little hook right here off to the side. That way I can roll up the, the lines and set them, set the inlet line off here. Same thing on the other side for the for the outlet line. But yeah, I'm just gonna make some uh, some rope handles right here, and it'll be nice. I'm gonna keep my that little. It's just a little rectangle solar charger that I ordered, a uh, trickle charger. So that way I make sure that I, I never deplete this battery. But I think this is gonna work. It's gonna work great. All right. Thank you for watching.